If you don't own a pet, what are you doing with your life? Pets are the best ever. They're like people, but not. Now obviously, you didn't see it, because I'm not going to put it in the video, but I'll tell you, I spent the last 30 minutes trying to stumble my way through some real emotional thing, and it was going to be about, like, uh, memory or something. And then I talked for another five minutes about goals, and then I talked for another ten minutes about overcoming fear. And then I went outside and I played with my cats. And I came back rejuvenated, although it was probably also because I got outside in the sun and not trapped in my room all day. Staying inside all day can't be too good for your mental health. I'll, I'll admit that. It wasn't just the cats. But you get the point. Literally the first time I go outside is to feed the cats and take care of them and all that. But then I come back in and I just... All day, pretty much. But you know, I went outside and I pet my cats and I teased them with a little toy. And they went all crazy. And then I got this cute little baby who, well, not really a baby anymore, like a couple months old. But I got this cute little baby who is so crazy and hunts everything. And like her favorite toy is just throwing a leaf up in the air and letting it go. And she just goes, wow. <laughs> it's the most adorable thing ever. But I'm rejuvenated. I'm happy. I'm feeling good about the day. And that's thanks to my cats, my pets. Everyone should get a pet. What are you doing? Go out and get a pet. If you have a pet, get another one. Or a smaller one, because you know, you don't want like two giant dogs unless you have a big enough house. I know a guy with two giant dogs. My step, my brother-in-law. He has two big dogs. They're a canine thing. That's a, that's a video for another day. So yeah. Get some pets.